cassowary. The cassowary is a very unique and weird bird. In many ways, it resembles a dinosaur more than a bird. A cassowary is a very tall bird. They can stand up to six feet tall and weigh over a hundred pounds. They have very small wings and they are not able to fly, but they can run and jump very fast and far. They can run up to 31 miles an hour and jump up to six feet high. The fastest human can only run 28 miles an hour. A cassowary has three toes and their second toe is a very sharp claw. They do not have tail feathers like many birds. This bird is also a very solitary bird. They live in the forest and they live mainly on fruit. Finally, they have a large cask on their head. The scientists don't know exactly the purpose of the cask, but it looks pretty cool. There's the cassowary, a fruit-eating, three-toed, fast, scary bird found in Australia. Thanks for Cricket is found in Australia and other parts of the world and has several weird and unique features. This cricket is medium sized and is typically one to three centimeters in length. However, if you take a look at this insect, you will notice that the front limbs are adapted for digging. In fact, these front limbs look very similar to the limbs of a mole. The cricket uses these limbs to dig underground. This is another unique and weird feature of this insect. It spends most of its life underground in tunnels that it digs. These tunnels allow it to escape predators, eat roots and grasses, and maybe an occasional worm. Finally, the males attract their mate by singing. Much like Frank Sinatra and Justin Bieber, the male sings in order to attract a female. They actually dig a special tunnel that roughly resembles a musical instrument and then they start to sing. The cricket produces a song by rubbing the left and right forelimbs together, a little bit like a bow and cello. So there you have a mole cricket, an underground, root-eating, singing cricket found in Australia and other parts of the world. found in Australia. The paralysis tick is found in Australia. They get their name because they can cause paralysis in the host animal that they attach to. This tick lives by drinking the blood of the host animal. The tick attaches to the host animal and starts drinking its blood. The tick can enlarge two or three or maybe even four times their original size. In addition to drinking the host blood, the paralysis tick injects toxins that can cause the organism to become paralyzed and may eventually even cause death. A typical victim may be a dog or a cat. The tick lands on the dog or the cat. It begins to suck out the blood and grow in size. The tick will stay attached to the dog for three or more days. After three or four days, the dog or cat may begin to walk with stiff legs, almost like it's drunk. This will continue to progress until the animal will be unable to lift their head. If untreated with anti-venom, the dog or cat may eventually die. Although uncommon, the same process can happen in humans. The Paralysis Tick of Australia, another weird and scary animal found in Australia. Found in Australia. In this episode, I'd like to look at the flying fox. The flying fox is not actually a fox. Instead, it is a giant bat. This bat, found in Australia, can have a wingspan up to five feet. Imagine a bat 
with a wingspan of four or five feet. Let's take a look at some of these in action. out at night and walking into this animal. Yikes. The good news, they feed on fruit, nectar, and blossoms. Another weird feature of this Australian bat is that they do not hunt with echolocation like most traditional bats do. Instead, they rely on their smell to locate food. So I guess that's good news. They don't attack found in Australia, the giant centipede. Australia is home to some weird and dangerous animals. Even the centipedes found in Australia are dangerous. Take this giant centipede. It measures up to six inches in length. In addition to being large, this centipede is also venomous. It injects the venom from claws that are found near its head. This centipede has between 21 and 23 pairs of legs, and the first pair of legs wrap around the head and is used to inject the poison. The venom is deadly to insects and small rodents, but is not strong enough to kill large mammals. People who are stung report that it hurts for several days, but no deaths have been reported from this venom. The animal lives under logs, leaves, and rocks, and hunts, hunts insects, worms, and snails, and it does all this at night, so it's a nocturnal hunter. Anyway, there's the giant centipede of Australia, another weird animal. Strange Australian animal, the stonefish. The stonefish is found in waters off the coast of Australia, and some species live even in fresh water. What makes this Australian fish so weird? Several things. First, take a look at it. It resembles a stone. The shape and color of the stonefish allows it to blend in to the ocean floor. And this allows it to ambush fish for a tasty meal. The other weird and scary feature of this stonefish is that it has enough venom in it that it can actually kill humans. The stonefish is one of the most venomous fish in the world. Because they blend into the ocean floor, many swimmers step on this fish, which triggers it to inject venom into the victim. Good news, most victims can treat the injection and they do not die. And finally, this weird fish can live out of water for up to 24 hours. Thanks for watching.